The Android for Work Work Managed Enrollment can be done by IT staff or end users. The enrollment is done on brand new devices or factory reset devices. The main advantage is that no personal Google account is needed during the enrollment or later device usage. There is different enrollment methods available. The most common ones are either tapping the home screen on a new or factory reset device seven times to download a QR code reader, after which a QR code can be scanned that would provide enrollment information like the LWatch server and a staging username and password. Alternatively, if no QR code has been generated, the normal device enrollment can happen in a way that users connect to a network accept the standard prompts on the device and once they reach the Google screen type the following tag AFW hash AirWatch This tag is recognized on the devices and they will automatically suggest to download the AirWatch MDM agent. Users can install the AirWatch agent, after which the standard AirWatch enrollment process will come into place. Users can enroll by using the email address, server details or QR code. I will use the email address method in this point. I will need to authenticate with my username and password or I can provide a staging account if this enrollment is done through IT stuff. The username and password can be an Active Directory username and password or it can be a basic account created in AirWatch for that particular user. Active Directory integration is usually suggested but not required. As part of the setup, in an Android for Work enabled environment, AirWatch will now create a Work Managed Google account on this device. Work Managed Google accounts have the advantage that they are not personal accounts that a user would need to create and maintain or manage. They are automatically generated and users will get the option to add a personal Google account if IT allows. But the main idea of Android for Work Work Managed mode is that users will not need to have a personal Google account on their devices. They will have access to the public Play Store, but only to applications which have been previously whitelisted by the administrators of the AirWatch environment. Based on the environment requirements, users will be prompted to create the according password. So here we have now an Android for Work enrolled device. I started with a factory reset or brand new device. And without needing a personal Google account, I got this device enrolled. 
One advantage of the Android for work managed mode is that any public applications that have been targeted with automatic installation will automatically appear on the device. Users will not be prompted for acceptance, users will not be prompted for Google IDs, the applications are just pushed down to the device. Android for Work also supports application configuration, which means that applications that just have been pushed down can be pre-configured by administrators to contain configuration information like URLs to connect to pre-filled usernames, etc. Users do have access to the AirWatch catalog from where they can install additional applications which are flagged as on demand all through the work managed Google account, not requiring a personal Google account. Administrators can select if users are allowed to add personal Google accounts or if this functionality is locked, then users are stuck with the work managed account and can only install the pre-approved applications.